Okay, so what we're going to do in today's lesson is what is a variable? So a variable in programming is an unknown. It's a way of giving a letter or a number or a text a meaning or representation. So imagine in, in program we have a box, okay? And that box is a storage in the computer's memory, okay? And we can put anything in that box. We can put letters, we can put numbers, we can put text, and we label the box. So let's say, for example, I'm going to label this box X. Okay. And I've got, say, the numbers 30, and the numbers 25, and the number and the letter, or the word hello. Okay. And I've got another box. I'm going to create another box, and I'm going to call this... Why? Now, what I can say, I can say, well, a variable, I'm going to store something in that variable. So I'm going to take this value 30 and I'm going to put it into the box in here. So this now has the number 30 inside it. So in programming, I can say that the box X or the location labeled X is stores the value 30. So in Python, if I was to go print X, it would give me 30. Alternatively, as well as putting in numbers, I could also put text. So I could put the word hello into here. So now hello is stored in this box. And if I wanted and I said print the value of the box Y, it would give me hello. And you can store anything in these boxes and you can have as many boxes as you like in the computer's memory. The key thing about the box is A, you've created a space in the computer's memory and B, that you give the box a label. In this case, I've given it the label X and the label Y, but you could give it any label you want as long as you use the same label when you want to use the value. You can also take the contents of boxes and do calculations with them. So, for example, let's create, say I create another box and this one I'm going to call X2, so box 2 basically. <coughs> And I'm going to put the value 25 into x2. I could then say x box x2 equals itself plus the other box. And what you could then say is print x2, which would tell me, OK, what's in box x2? Well, we've got the box, the value 25. What's in box x? Oh, we've got the value 30. So it'd add and it'd say and then put those values into box x2. So it would end up back in x2. And that would give me 25 plus 30, so be 55, okay? So that's what a variable is. I'm going to explore variables now in a little exercise you're gonna do using Python.